and they starved me today because uh, of my van broke down last night on the way back from work which left me stranded on a slip road into a dual carriageway so I'm just going to talk to the guys now and see what can be done with it um, but it, um, I was going to talk something and it's been bugging me a bit lately it seems that like the end of uh, the summer is like prime time for charity rides and and uh, obviously these are mass ride outs and stuff and I've been watching a lot of people's videos and stuff of you know the whole ride and all that type of stuff and I think something needs to be said really because it seems more and more there's a growing number of people on these ride outs who are just acting like complete dicks complete dicks I watched one the other night, there's a guy doing a burnout on the high street. Now, the, that's that's not what these events are about. These events are about a big cross-section of people who ride bikes coming together to pay like a fiver to help a cause out and all we ride as a big group. And yeah, it's a bit of a spectacle for the general public. It's not it's not this uh, ride of the century bullshit that keeps flying about with people doing taking up three lanes of the motorway doing doing wheelies all the way down and it, yeah it just seems to be a growing problem yeah yeah redline your bike in the tunnel every now and again but normally these things are on a Sunday morning that start about nine o'clock So yeah, go and have fun, but don't, you'll, you'll get a section, is it t section 23, where the police can disperse a group because of a, not a disturbance, and it's just, yeah, if you want to drive, if you want to go and ride fast, piss off and ride with somebody else, or go and ride on your own. But it's really not about that. It, I think it's disrespectful because you don't even know these people that you're riding around either. You don't know what they're going to do, and they don't know what you're going to do. So just be it. Just be fucking respectful. I said to myself, I'm going to swear on this video, but it's something that it needs addressing. And I think organisers, I thought that they've got a responsibility, but they need to kind of set the boundaries as it were and say look this is this is the deal if you don't like it just don't come and I know that a lot of the uh, UK vloggers at the minute had a bit of a problem with that well a few of them I don't know if they were actually with the ride or not but yeah the, the, the general rule is if you're on a small ride out of about 10 maximum the people who want to go fast, and if you know the route, they clear off, and then they'll wait because they want to, they want to push a bit. Those that don't stay with the rest of the group. But when you've got like 300 going down a high street, you cannot be wheeling and doing burnouts on a high street. Yeah, just just have a think about that next time before you uh, think of popping the front wheel up in a 30.